Hey guys, I hope everybody is taking care and being blessed today. Today's video is going to be a um, something a little different. Um, I am actually going to add this right here to my garage door. Here is the garage door. It's actually a double door, double garage door. Um, I've seen this. Uh, one of my neighbors had it, so it made me want to be able to get it. The first time I ordered it is I made a mistake is... Yes, I, made a mistake. I made a mistake and ordered one but it had nails and screws so make sure it's not a nail and screw one this one is actually a magnetic so I had to wait I had to go back to Home Depot return it and then order this but it actually came really fast so that's a good thing okay so let's go ahead and get it open you know it takes me forever to get it open what is in the package is you have the little strips see I don't know if you see this see that you had a little the little two little knobs and you have the strips also um, and I also seen some, my other neighbor have one and it's really nice too. Um, it's a little different. So look around and see which one you can get and see which one you like. But let me go ahead and get it open. Yeah, it always takes me forever to get everything open. I feel like saying 20 hours later. No, I'm just like, <laughs> y'all yeah, still trying to get it open. Y'all finally got it open. It be taking me forever. How many of y'all comment below? If it take y'all forever to get these packages open, these boxes open, when you get stuff from online. And it still ain't all the way open. Oh my gosh. And you gotta be careful with this, because this type of plastic, it will cut you. So be careful with this. Oh my God, hold on y'all. 20 hours later. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Five made it about... Maybe about 10 minutes later. Okay, so I got it out. I also wanted to go over with you guys um, weatherproof plastic installs in seconds. I actually put it um, on my car because I was trying to give out the packaging and it was magnetic to my car. So it has good magnetic um, classic spade. Again, it is called a decorative magnetic garage accent. Okay, so you're going to get that on um, Home Depot, Amazon, whatever. Um, again, it is... Um, garage accessory magnetics okay so let's go ahead this is what you it comes with it comes with the handles two handles and it also comes with the um arrows some of them come with like little dots and stuff because i've seen dots i've seen all kind of different ones so just look and see and i know you'll find one that you like okay so what i want to do first guys is i want to make sure that i um put it in a good area so what you want to do is look at it first see how you want to lay it um i know that usually when you have let's put this down usually when you have handles you know handles usually be and i don't think you should put it on i wouldn't put it in the creases y'all don't put it in the creases because once it goes up you don't want it to um not go up because your little handle's there okay so y'all am going to put the handles right let me look at my nail okay so let's put them about this is about right there let's put them about right there make sure you even it up even it out even it out even it out y'all make sure it's even look wait hold on wait hold on see now if i didn't look at this look y'all one is look like it's different than the other that's not the case i got one the opposite way so make sure you put both of them the same way and hold on y'all let me see something okay so the way that the thing is doing it the smaller ones y'all go on the top and the larger ones go on the bottom and that's what's good that is magnetic i can always move it around look at it see how you like it see if you like where it is and if i was you i would go ahead and make your garage door go up so you can make sure your garage door go up instead of you get all on and then you realize your garage door don't go up okay guys so we have this on there so let's go ahead and open up the garage to make sure it go up you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and just put it all on and then I'm gonna take it off the garage. I mean, put it up once I get everything on. So let me see, let me look at my neighbors. He have his going like this. And I wanna look, make it look, and like I said, kinda go over. Can you see that? Hold on, hold on guys. So kinda make you make sure you're not going in these creases, okay? So when the garage door go up, it can be able to go up. And I'm gonna put it like right there. Hold on. That's a blooper, y'all. Why every time I buy something, it always got to fall? Like, I'm serious. 
it always gotta wind up falling they got it in break okay so let me see what my name other name how she have okay so they took it and it's like right there can you see that see so i took this one y'all and put it right there and what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna put it on the same exact side i mean same exact way but on that side now okay let's do it Put them over here because they won't break. Okay. It takes some before and after pictures, y'all, so you can see how good they look. Make sure you put it right on the same thing. So that's kind of on that little crease. You want it looking like you really nailed it in there. And it's got a nice grip, y'all. Really nice grip. And then what I want you to do, once you get it completely on there, just go back and look at it. Make sure you got it right. Let's see how I got that one. That one is close to I don't just don't know how happy I am. I do not have to uh, nail anything, screw anything. There's no tools needed, none of that. Look how good this look already. Oh my God. Look at this, y'all. Just by putting that on, how good you can make your garage look. By just adding some magnets. And it was not even that expensive. Just go to homedepot.com. I gave you all the information. I'm going to try to include a link, but I don't know if it's available still. Go to Amazon and you can be able to get these. And like I said, it's different ones that you can get too. So let's go ahead and Try to look up, lift up the garage and see what happened. And I'm going to go kind of far back too to make sure everything is easy. It worked. It worked. And it looked good. Okay. So that's just me showing you guys something simple to be able to just add some spoof to your garage. And again, I will include all the information in the video description box. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Be blessed, guys. Bye.